Hey guys, I just wanted to share with you how I store my lipsticks. So this is what I picked up from Michael's Craft Store. Ooh, here we go. I don't know when to stop. Okay, so this is the unit. There's one, two, three, four. Sorry, it's a little jerky here, but I'm on a tripod. And then I have my Lady Moss lipstick holder on there. So let me show you what's inside each of these drawers. So I just finished putting this together or like over here on the side. So I wanted to share before the sun kind of comes into my room that I've been cleaning and I've been excited. So I want to share with you how I store lipsticks and lip glosses. And I think it's fantastic. So at the very, very top are my lipsticks and lip glosses that I love. These are here for my Shu Yamura. Dose of colors are amazing. Then I have my Urban Decay. I have my NYX Butters. These are my lip glosses from L'Oreal and I have my Benefit lipsticks. So these are just kind of ones I really like to use. And this is my really pretty case um, lipstick holder from Lady Moss. Then we have the drawers. So it's three drawers a piece for each unit and this is my first drawer. These are all of my lipsticks from Milani and L'Oreal, my favorite Makeup Forevers, and my Maybellines. So how these are holding in here is actually, let me pull it out for you to see. It's this thing right here, you can see that? And I have it inside of this drawer. But you can actually divide it into slots. Oh, the sun is here. I was trying to avoid this guy. Yeah, so you just kind of put the slots in there and then it's all nicely divided into three pieces. And then in my next drawer, I have, I tried to keep it all nice and neat, but you know how that goes. These are my NYX butters and then I have my NYX mattes and I have a couple of these right here, these glam sticks. They're just so pretty. And then I have these right here. These are the L'Oreal Infallible. I love them. I have so many backups. I can't part with them. So these can actually see in this drawer, yeah? Okay. Then, in my last lipstick drawer, oh, it's so weird. Okay. Are my fancy ones. These are my Urban Decay. And then I have my MAC. I don't have so many MAC lipsticks. I have like the main really bright ones. And I have Pro Longwear. And I have my Too Faced. These are, oh, these cream ones are just a dream. And then I got this right here once from Drugstore. Sealed with a Kiss Lip Fixative. I don't know if it works. It just kind of felt weird on my lips, so I didn't use it. On to the lip gloss drawer. I used to have it in my mom, my M-A-L-M dresser from Ikea. But now I moved everything into here. And I used to be in separation like this too as well. So these are all of my red lip glosses. These are all of my corals. I wish Mac would bring this back. A lot of these I don't want to use because I just I just love them to pieces. Like this right here is so fancy, so I don't want to use it. And then these are like the nudes. And these are the Dazzle Glass for Mac. And I loved it. I just I had to have them all because they were so so thick and sticky and glittery and just everything. And then this is my next drawer right here. These are all of my pinks. This is some new lip injections that I haven't touched from Too Faced. And then these are purples. I have my Lime Crime Carousel. And I have this. Oh my gosh, this right here is from Stila. I love it. There's one with like a jewel on it. But, um, oh, here it is. Oh, it's pretty. And then over here I have my lip liners. And then I have my Pro Lipstick from MAC Pro. So pretty much when I'm working on someone, it'd be something little like this. All this right here is personal makeup. And then in the last drawer, my little last drawer right here are my NYX matte, they're soft matte lip creams. All the colors right here. And that is my lip collection. So they used to go in here, red, orange, yellow, in my drawer of my dresser, but I moved everything to my new stuff. So basically I have my top lip products, then I have my lipsticks, and then my lip glosses, and then lashes, and then stuff. So that is how I store everything. This white piece right here could be purchased at Michael's. So this one right here is a little bit shorter than the ones below. And I mean, you've got to look different. Michaels carries different ones. I don't remember how much it was. It was definitely less than 20 bucks. I think it was probably $19.99. But these right here are so cute. It actually has these right here, but 
nine times. So I didn't care because it's really one big drawer. So I only put two and then again. So the box looks like, oh my gosh, it's so heavy. So the box looks like this. Oh, it's so heavy. I'm at a weird angle. But it looks like this and then there's a bunch of different styles. So I just kind of collect them when there's a sale and stuff and then I just start putting them in my room. So there you have it, my lip gloss and lipstick collection. If you have any questions, let me know, or if you want to go over something a little bit more in detail, like my favorites or anything like that. And then I will continue on with the rest of my collection as I do these new videos. Thanks guys for watching, bye.